Hey guys, this is Derek with Cherry Blossom Hemp back with another Did You Know? And did you know that you can actually consume raw hemp? This is the truth, man. I, it's crazy because I was talking to this guy about a year ago and he was telling me that um, he was making what he called jute. And jute is like a, a beverage that like almost like a smoothie and this is probably the best way you can consume this stuff you know so he puts in the smoothie he was giving it to his son his son had some sort of i don't know what i don't give me lying i don't know what kind of ailment he had but he said this was having miraculous effects on his son so i kind of think about that for a while i said like, can you really just eat like raw hemp and yes you can it turns out like you can take the leaves you put it in a salad you can grind it up and put it on whatever you want or break it up or um but yeah like in a smoothie i think it's probably the most common way uh and this saying like it gets loaded with fiber it's loaded with protein antioxidants vitamins minerals like it's crazy just like any other vegetable um people are like putting it on pizza like you know as a pizza topper um and then it's like for flavoring and the cool thing is it's like this thca not thc which is kind of the precursor to thc it means that you need to have heat or some sort of <clears throat> heat and time applied to the leaves or the raw cannabis to actually get you intoxicated so in its raw form it's non-intoxicating it's just like any, any other vegetable so we found this like it's absolutely amazing we're going to give it a shot. I think in the next week or so, I'm probably going to make a smoothie out of some, but they'll and kind of maybe do this on camera, show you how easy this can really be uh, and how quickly, like you could take something that you've been using, you know, in, in a wholly different way, like every single day of your life, vaping, smoking, whatever. And now you can just use it as like a raw food supplement. And they, they, people are saying how this may be one day readily available, just the grocery store, just go and pick up some cannabis leaves, you know, or some hemp leaves or what have you, <clears throat> and just put it right in your food. Now, there's some caveat here and this stuff comes out the ground. Sometimes it's made with, um, you know, or grown with pesticides or something like that. You want to try to get this to resource these things from places where you're not getting pesticides. But, um, it, you know, even if, even if so, you do find some, some raw hemp, you always wash it. It's always a safety measure to wash anything that you're going to actually put in your mouth and consume. I find it's better just to soak it instead of just rinsing it. Uh, somehow submerging things in water tends to pull more of the dirt and, and grit and stuff off of there. But that's it for today. Um, that's all for Did You Know. We'll see you next week with another episode of Did You Know. We're going to be absent for like a week in about two weeks. Um, going away, but I'll be back the week after. So as always, like, subscribe, share, and comment. And I'm going to get back at this garden. So grow some more uh, ed edible foliage. All right. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye. Help, like, subscribe, share, and comment.